This beautiful lady, Alma Randolph Crump, is so well known and much beloved in the tri-state. She served the kids of Owensboro for now 30 years. 30 years, congratulations, and man, can she sing. And you're going to get to hear her uh, from an upcoming gospel concert. And it's Alma and Friends. Alma and Friends. You have lots of friends. I and hope so. <laughs> and, and talented friends, too. Absolutely. So tell us the story behind this event, because back in the day, I was on there with you. you it's been a hosted. while. Absolutely. Yes. You served as MC. So the Alma Randolph Charitable Foundation was established in 1993. As you stated, we are commemorating our 30th anniversary this year, and we have two fundraising events uh, scheduled. Uh, Sunday, August the 13th, Alma and Friends will be held at the Owensboro Convention Center. And our special guest will be the St. Stephen's Praise Team from Louisville and also Higher Praise Quartet from Greenville. And along with Brandon Joseph, he is um, a mime from Louisville. Oh, how and just, yeah, he does an awesome job on stage. Um, Bishop Robert Randolph, who happens to be my brother. <laughs> and then we're pulling together a community choir that will be called the Voices of Love. So if you're interested in singing in the Voices of Love, we would love to have you. And then um, we will have the Friendship Choir, which will feature children from the community second through the sixth grade. And of course, I will be singing. Yes, I hope so. <laughs> I certainly hope so. For the people who would like to sing in these community choirs, what's the time commitment and where are, is there going to be a rehearsal? Three rehearsals. All of the rehearsals will be held at 4th Street Baptist Church. We have the information posted on our Facebook page. And um, also, they can go to our website. And we would love to, we would love to have them. Well, it would be just be fun. Yes. To, to, really you know, are they be. singing one or two songs? Uh, the Friendship Choir will be um, under the direction of Dan Douglas, and they're doing three. And then um, Minister Jerry Flowers is directing the Voices of Love, and they will be doing three songs What a well. great opportunity. Yeah. And to support your work. You know, congratulations on 30 years oh, of service. So is this a fundraiser to the gospel this concert? This is a fundraiser to um, our gold sponsor for the concert is Waxworks, um, also uh, partnering with Adventures. And then um, our platinum sponsors for the concert and the Black and White Gala in October. Um, we're just so delighted that Bill and Joe Barron agreed to be the, uh, the platinum and the presenting sponsors for uh, both events and the proceeds, the net proceeds from these events will be used to uh, fund our HUDS project where we uh, upgrade the living conditions of disadvantaged families. And so we're pretty excited um, about this year's uh, events as well as looking back over 30 years and just knowing that it was the hand of God that has brought us this far. I do not uh, uh, take any of the credit for the success of the foundation, nor does our, our board members and volunteers, but we know that he's in charge and, and I feel that it was a divine calling on my life uh, in 1993 to establish Well, you've certainly changed lives in this well, community for kids everywhere and now families, yeah. Alma. So thank you for what you do and thank, thank you for bringing you. this. And I hope you'll come back before the black and white ball. We would love Maybe to. Maybe we'll let Ron sit in on that interview. Yeah, that now, would be great. there you go. How about Ron that? is going to be emceeing, so we would love it. Well, it'll be a lively party. <laughs> oh, I promise you. I promise you it will be. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank it's you. always great to see you. Thank you. We'll be back with more Local Lifestyles right after this. Stick around.